Hey everyone, welcome to I'm Elaine. It's your girl Mimi. So I know most of you know that I post at least once a week, usually on Thursday, Friday, or Saturday. And um, that's how I've been doing it for quite a while, just because, you know, life happens. And just recently I got a, a new job, which I will talk about a little bit later at the end of the video. I want to kind of get into the haul first, just in case you're here for the haul. And then I'll jump into update about what I do for my job, et cetera, et cetera. I've been getting questions on Twitter about, you know, what are you posting? Because my job has a lot to do with Twitter. So anyways, if you want to know more about what I'm doing in life, then you can stick to the end of the video. Real quick, because this does pertain to fashion and beauty, et cetera, what I do here, um, there is this new website that I was contacted by the creator and it's actually an awesome idea. Awesome, awesome, awesome idea. Not sure if there's other websites like this. They contacted me. They liked what I they like what I do here on I Am Elaine. The website is called Top Floor. And I know that they're trying to get a whole bunch of beauty people on YouTube, a whole bunch of beauty and fashion, excuse me, people in blogs, etc. Basically influencers if you want to call them that. Um <laughs> Do I influence you? Let me know. I know my girl April Athena, she's doing it as well. And so anyways, um, it's called Top Floor and we, I, we are basically buyers for our own stores on Top Floor. So I have my own store, I have my own collections. Um, that's what they call it, collections. And if you go to topfloor.com forward slash I am Elaine, I'm basically a buyer for my own store on that website, which is really cool. If you go into like Macy's and you know Nordstrom's and wherever you go to shop, usually there's a buyer um, that will pick out the clothes selectively and then buy them for Macy's and then they'll sell them at Macy's. So this is kind of like that. My collections are growing, um, but I have like plus size clothing, the affordable plus size clothing is one of my collections. Um, gosh, my favorite nail polishes right now, uh, uh, my favorite jewelry I'm loving, flats I'd wear, things like that. So I will link Top Floor, I am a lane below. I think it's a cool way um, just to kind of like shop shop what I would buy or what I buy. Um, it's just, I don't know, it's, it's a better way to kind of just link your viewers to what you love. I also think that anyone can sign up for this now. Don't call me on it. I will put any like annotations or whatever around my face if I'm wrong, but I feel like anyone can sign up for Top Floor and like create their own stores. So if you have an audience, even if you don't, if you have Facebook, um, if you just want to share what you love as far as fashion and beauty, um, or even more than that, I think they have like kitchen and stuff on there. Anyways, it's for everybody. Um, and I think you can go right now and sign up. It's free. So I think everyone should take advantage of it. Did a little bit of shopping. This is kind of like a collective haul. I did it over the past month. I really have not been shopping a lot lately. I just been kind of using what I have as far as makeup. Um, so you're not going to really see any makeup. Um, but I have been shopping for earrings because I've just been going crazy for like studs. I'm like, I need some studs. I know Forever 21 has cheap studs. Um, and if your ears aren't too, too sensitive, you could probably get away with wearing Forever 21 studs. So I have some studs to show you from Forever 21 that I just got. Like seriously, you can probably run out and get them. Um, and then some things from Sephora. So that is what the haul is going to be about today. Enjoy. What I'm wearing on my lips right now is from Lime Crime. And this is the only one I own from them. It's Contessa, Contessa Fluorescent. Contessa Fluorescent. I absolutely love this. Um, it kind of has like, a, it's, it's def in person, it looks pink on the camera, but in person it's, it's definitely purple, purple pink. And I really, really like it. It's really, really bright. The only problem with Lime Crime is that on their website, they're always sold out of everything I want. Um, so you just got to be on it when they post it. So I always recommend following like Lime Crime on Facebook or something because then they'll let you know when their stuff is up. Anyways, these are my first ones. These are not studs. These are the only ones I own that are like dangly for the new, you know, but I love it. So it looks like this and it's just like I feel like I'm, um, what are those wind chimes? That's what it feels like. It's very, you know, like Aztec, -y, you know, it's just very, I don't know, tribal. I really, really like the colors. I mean, that's what kind of attracted me to it was the colors, um, were the colors. I think these were like $5. I don't normally spend over six bucks at Farm 21 for their earrings because they do tend to change colors and things like that because they're cheap, you know? The next ones I have yet to wear. I'm so excited to wear these. I think those are leopards, right? or cheetahs, I don't know, leopards, I don't know, tell me. I think these are so freaking adorable to wear. 
Maybe I'll wear it with like, I'm thinking like with an all black outfit. I think this with like a gold bracelet or gold chain, gold chain, gold chained bracelet with these would be rocking. So, so pretty. I love them. You cannot beat it. And they look so, I don't know. I love them so much. They're just like, I've been looking everywhere for kind of flowers like these. Okay, my girl, uh, Nazi's Beauty, Shnaz, uh, she always wears these earrings that she got from Jewel Mint like a while back, and I can't find them anywhere. And I went to Forever 21, Shnaz, you will be so proud of me, and I found some that look just like yours, girl. Look how cute those are. How cute. I love, I love, I love, I love, like, just weird earrings like this, like, just different shapes. I just, I love it so much. Anyways, so those are my spring earrings that I bought. And Sephora recently had their 15% off. If you're a VIB, you got the email and you got the card in the mail. In the store I went, I bought, I was just like, because I already did an online order and I used my gift card and I really just, I'm not, like I said, I'm really just trying to use up what I have as far as makeup and stuff. But I found this and I don't even know if anyone was talking about this on YouTube. I think I just saw it and I was like, I need this. This was $6. This is the called the pink face brush. And this is in the packaging. This is what it looks like know that they sell like just a, a brush that literally goes on your face and you go like this like if it were a Clarisonic. I don't know how much better it works. I'm sure the Clarisonic just whips this thing's butt but um this was six bucks. And I kind of wanted to give it a go. It is kind of dirty. I apologize. Um oh not too bad. Not too too bad. But yeah I mean I've been using it a few times already. I mean I leave it in the shower and I'll use it at night when I'm using my my normal cleanser for Mary Kay. Um but like, I like it. Like, I don't really know if it does anything. I mean, I know when I'm done cleaning that this thing is dirty as heck. Um, but it was $6, and I figured, why not have something a little extra than me just using my hands to put my cleanser on? Finally got it, guys. The Beauty Blender. How exciting is this? This is the, um, the, the value pack. Um, it comes with the Beauty Blender Cleanser, Beauty Blender Cleanser, and two Beauty Blenders. I never really got into the whole Beauty Blender thing. I'm like, I don't know if it's my thing, because um, I do like my brushes, I like my stippling brush, etc., etc., for liquid foundation. Um, but anyways, this is what it looks like. Oh, sorry, it's a little dirty. This is what it looks like when it's wet. It's pretty big. It's pretty freaking big, and I really, I, I think it gives. I used it today. I think it gives a, a nice flawless finish, like they say. It looks. It makes your foundation. Now I use the Revlon um, Color Stay, and it makes your foundation look very natural. It, I don't know if it's just because of my foundation, but it really does look very natural on the face. It looks like you just applied very light coverage so I really do like it for that um, and I also like it from you know putting on concealer I like it for highlighter so it's actually a really really great tool look how little that is and I heard that they also come in black and white so I've only seen them in pink at Sephora one of these is like 20 bucks so the pack with the extra beauty blender and the soap the, the cleanser is oh, was like 35 bucks and I was like heck yeah $15 more and you get an extra one of these and a cleanser so anyways I jumped on that and I got the 15% off so I was very very proud of myself I used my Sephora gift card from Christmas um on this so thank you cuz this cleanser claims to be able to wash all of your brushes great for makeup brushes too so um, we'll, we'll see. We'll give this a go and see how it is. Have you guys ever smelled Marc Jacobs Daisy? Like, am I the only one in the world that has never smelled that? OMG. This is, um, the rollerball version. So cute. It's little flowers. Um, anyways, I do eventually want to get the full-size bottle, but the rollerballs, rollerballs last quite a while and they're only 20 bucks usually. It's just nice to have in your purse when you just need that refreshment, especially when you're a deodorant is wearing off. Ladies, you know what I mean? Um, it's just, it's just, it's, oh, it just smells like heaven. Like I love, it's just like a fresh, just a fresh smell. Like, can it just be that? If you guys are wondering about my weight, because I know my last video I posted was the Polar FT4 heart rate monitor watch, um, review and I, I advise everyone to go and just watch it um because 
a lot of people have so many questions on it so that's why I put it up so my weight update will is is live right now on it's Mimi's life 101 so if you want to know a little bit more about what's been going on with my exercise routine and my weight journey my weight loss my weight gain whatever it is um, you can go check it out now I'll put that link below as well now for the job what do you do Mimi I work now at this awesome website that deals with video and writing score I work for blaze blaze basically gives you the hottest videos right now so if you're into videos if you're into the news if you're into pop culture whatever we do entertainment health beauty uh, fashion uh, music we do everything like everything that we can cover and we always have a video attached to our writing so you'll always get a video and that's what makes that's what makes us different um, is that we'll always have a video for you um, that we find um, that we think is entertaining so if there's something trending on YouTube it's gonna be on blaze and that's just how it is so I think it's really cool especially if you are a video watcher I I personally work I work in all of the cat all of the categories but I was hired to specifically focus on fashion and beauty so if you are on Twitter you will see everything like follow me on Twitter at I am Elaine and you'll get pretty much everything I write I, I always link out um, and I do try to pick a lot of beauty people uh, that I know, that I watch, try to give them a little bit of, you know, publicity. Why not? I have so much fun doing it. I just want to, you know, let you guys know. So if you are following me on I Am Elaine, you're probably going to get a lot of those links. What's one I just did? Oh yeah, Corey Monteith. <laughs> he plays Finn Hudson on Glee. He just got out of rehab yesterday. So my uh, list, what I created was, let's revisit some of uh Finn Hudson's most sexiest Glee performances. So that's one of the things that I created, the article I created with the videos that I like from him, and I tweeted it out. So anyways, that's kind of what I, where I'm going with this. So um, yeah, Blaze, you can follow Blaze at, at Blaze on Twitter, blaze.com. Go on there every day, daily. I mean, everything is changing hourly. So if you like videos, it's great to check out Blaze. So yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoyed my little update. Love you. Bye.